three, two, one. Off we go. The pottery battle. Oh, man. The midges here are terrible. This is the third out of five <coughs> battles. And today, we're battling for combustion devices. Bunch of really messed up ones in there. Julius and Dylan have two and a half hours to find clay. Jackpot. And make their best yeah. pottery items. Not a challenge, complete. You guys have voted on our Instagram for the winner, who at the end of this video will choose a combustion device for himself and also assign one to the loser. It's very important to win those battles and score some good survival items, because that's all we got for the real challenge coming up. At least the rain might help getting the midges away. With just the items won in these battles, we start on a dune for the island. From there, we individually have to make it to the extraction point within three days. Hey, I'm stuck. 50 kilometers away up the mountain. Who turns out to be the best survivalist? Stay tuned. Lekker chill houden. Ah, nice comfy day on the bushcraft benches. <laughs> That's right, we made it uh, in the first battle. And uh, today we're up for the third already. And again, there can be only be one bench on the perfect design place. <laughs> so uh, we got two and a half hours. And the first part of the challenge is to, get, to find your own clay, right? Mm -hmm. Then you have to come back here to camp and make whatever item or items you want to make. That's at the right. end of it, at the end of it, they will put aside and let dry, which is not part of the two and a half hours. Yeah, and bake it. And then uh, they get baked. Then we're gonna put a poll up on Instagram to see who the winner is. Exactly. So uh, we have our three basic tools again for this challenge. Not sure we're gonna need them all, mm -hmm. but anyways, axe, folding saw, and bushcraft knife. Three, two, one, off we go. Oh no. And I already have myself a digging stick. Yeah, we will allow using that. That's, I'm not sure about that now. Well, good luck carrying that. I put myself into a bit of pace now. And he's running. That's when you know uh, the challenge started. I need a digging stick. Okay, I'm going this way. And this is where we dug the clay up the last time. I'm just gonna have a quick peek here and see. Can I find some usable yeah. stuff? I think it should be good. Jackpot. Jackpot. That is of the cleanest, finest source with only the purest of ingredients. Let's get some more of that. What's that now? Can I use that to dig clay? Throwing it in nature. People messing, messing around. We got the topsoil, the subsoil, clay, rocks, and then silt in between. This is all super silty. That's actually, yeah, that's pretty silty. And then down here, you have like a really pure clay. There's a lot of rocks in between, but like for like hand pottery, you don't need that much. I'm gonna use my hat again. Put the clay in that, it's a little bit dirty, but it'll save me time, which is the main thing. Will do. And then start throwing in the lumps. I think this is all pretty, pretty good. I don't think Julius will get 100% either. You know, it's not like refined and store bought stuff. Like. It's pretty clay up here. Not having too much luck as of now. So, yeah, it's a lot of rocks, guys. It's not ideal. I might try one more spot or maybe two more spots. Kind of see where I got the most pure stuff the quickest. But I have one good batch here, I think so. I'm gonna bring that back to camp first. What about this stuff now? There's way too much gravel in that. It's very sticky. I guess I'm gonna have to clean a lot of that. Jaeger, yeah, are you waiting for me? Are you a good boy? Oh, you're a good boy. I'm actually gonna put this on a rock over here. What is that? Dirty head at the end of the day, but sure, who cares? 
I'm just going a bit further now to get a bit more. Oh, Jaeger's gonna join. Good boy, Jaeger. Seems to be quite pure. How would Dylan be doing? <laughs> It's taking really long. I'm not sure about it. It's a lot drier, so it crumbles apart, but there's more contamination, I feel. Yeah, it's too stony. It's just too stony. Dang it. Yeah, I have to find another spot. <gasps> One more spot to check. I'll go the other way. I hear, I hear Julius. Are you finding any? Oh yeah. I got two loads already. You got two loads already? Is it clean like? I'm just checking my third spot here. I have a little peek at what Dylan is doing there. Isn't yours like very stony? No. Oh man, I have bad news. My toes are getting wet. Oh man, my boot. <laughs> I have to join your club, Julius. Oh, no. My my boots have stopped being waterproof. Well, I'm happy. I'm not an only loser with bad boots. It's all full of grind, like. Of what? Um, gravel. Yep. What about yours? No, it's lovely. You taking up the brown stuff? Nope. And what the you take? The grey stuff you're taking? Yep. And you? Mine is full of gravel. I'm not too happy about my boots all of a sudden being leaking. Yeah, I'm really sorry, buddy, but I'm having all the struggles to worry about now. I'm surprised you didn't go to our old spot from the last time. I'm almost thinking taking the gamble right now. Yeah, I want to see what your quality is like. Man, find your own I was spot. there, then you're coming my way, man. <laughs> oh man, I can't stay here. The water. Everything is full of gravel or stones, man. No. Yeah, man, I'm taking a gamble. Yeah, I'm going all the way there. He's gonna go to a place that we've been already. But it's like uh, at least half an hour walking now. Okay. Officially challenged time. Sweat is up. <sighs> anyway, I got three things. I'm gonna try and refine them a little bit. You know, like filter out all the stuff. But the only thing I have is my hat. So I'm gonna dunk my hat in here. I hope I don't permanently wreck my, my hat. For sure. I'm gonna walk big time to a place. I'm for sure there is good clay. Horse jump. I'm taking the freaking time. Put down this camera here. Walk back and walk by again. My goodness. back to the river right here Ow. mysterious island very cool across the river right here put the freaking thing down here Bruce plantation, clear cut area. Nothing uh, wrong with doing some forestry, but it can be done a lot more sustainable than this. And I'm gonna do this at camp because the midges here are terrible. Blah. Okay, here's our clay spot. Look at it there, in the bank. Ooh. My head is wrecked. Oh well. 
So, my three batches, this is my first one, it's really clean, but I'm, I'm afraid it's too, eh, eh. thanks Jaeger, I'm afraid it's too, uh, too silty, and then what I have in my hat, I'm not too sure what that has become, so this kind of is my hope, I still need to refine it. Myself and Julius both carry an injury too. He really hurt his tenons on his arm and I really hurt my elbow joint. So the digging, you know, the shocks. Guess it's what? The freaking arm wrestling. How stupid is that? No, this spot is definitely not as good as I hope. And the midges here, man. Gravel. I'll use my board. Oh, this is going so nice. I'm gonna make a vase or like a a jug. A jug. I'm gonna make a jug. So by rolling it up like this, you really keep the consistency. And then after a while you'll you'll fuse them together. Dunk it in that stuff because I can. <laughs> a bowl is handy too, though. I was thinking, what is a a nice thing to have? A bowl you can drink out of, eat out of, but a water jug looks nicer. And you can put a lovely handle on it, and you know you have the shape where it where it, you know the spout. What do you call it? The spout. Uh, the midges are quite bad today. I hope we have some uh, ceramists in the in the comments as friends and subscribers to tell us what to do right next time. That'll be the base. And in the meantime, Julius is walk. <laughs> getting too carried away with rolling. I'm making them too thin, I feel. Thicker will be better. It'll be heavier. It'll take more clay, but it might be a bit stronger. And I definitely went too big on the, on the base. Just leave it alone, I think, and carry on. What was this again? Oh, a yeah, combustion device. <laughs> now, there is a really bunch of really messed up ones in there, like a flashlight. <laughs> and a bow drill set and what else was there two matches <laughs> i don't know what i would give julius bow drill set he'll manage i don't know maybe i should give him <laughs> this is if i win eh? this is if i win i actually have the feeling he's making it over there because he should be back by now if he isn't making it there he has definitely big problems because we got to be halfway by now uh, uh, but the midges are bad. <laughs> it's quite light. I really don't know. Like you put that in the oven, it's just gonna say goodbye. I'm gone. Uh, how is things here? I'm just on the toilet, man. I just you got, got it all break. done. Yeah, it's on. Oh my goodness, look at that, he already had got himself some. <sighs> All that work man, and, and I'm not even happy about my clay. And I'm wrecked. Oh, yours looks nice man. That's way cleaner. The basket. Am I allowed using that? No. Why not? Hell no, dude. It's from the last challenge. No? No, man, then I might as well use my pot that I have in my bag. Well, this is natural materials like. Okay. Come on, dude. Julius has come back. <laughs> and of course he's wrecked and he's making things way too complicated. He did get nice clay though, I have to say. It looks very smooth from here, I cannot judge, but... <laughs> look at my pile, man, look. 
you know? Look at my hat! <laughs> yeah, wow! It was a bit of an experiment. Might have gone the wrong way, but we'll see. Can I at least use a stone from here? Yeah. And he picks the flattest one. Yeah, that's a smart idea, isn't it? Very smart. I would have done the same. Okay, guys, let me see what we have here. What do you think the time is? Uh, one and a half hours in. How much cleaning do you have to do for? Yeah, a lot, man, a lot. It's yeah. really, it really sucks. I like, was thinking when you said, oh, no, my, my, yeah, don't bit, you have gravel in your stress, uh, you know. Oh, yes, that's just messing around with uh, your buddy, huh? Yeah, of course. Ay, 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 ay. What I was looking think? there, man, it was all full of gravel. I know, exactly. Yeah, well, it stressed me really out. That's the main reason why I went all the way further. <laughs> I had some pretty good patch, and but it just would need a lot of cleaning time. Well, to be honest, your clay looks so much better. I'm gonna need water. I left my axe down here. Earlier I was saying I hope there's some potters on the in the comment section, but it's ceramists, right? Ceramists? Like people who deal with clay and How do you call people doing pottery? They're not potters, are they? <laughs> Probably, I don't know. I'm not sure if that was time well spent, but whatever. Clean that out with a tiny bit of water to do some pottery with. And in the meantime, I don't want to tell Julius, but I'm struggling. I made my thing way too thin. It's too delicate. Like after I smoothen out this, there's very little strength in it, which is a problem. Let's make some progress. My goodness. What is happening, man? Yeah, I'm not an expert in pottery. You know, sometimes you make mistakes. Oh. And the thing goes bad, you know? Good luck. Well, we're all having struggles. Makes this one interesting. Half an hour is nearly over, man. No. Hey? 15 minutes? No? I don't know. I sure as hell hope so. <laughs> How'd you like that, Cron? I don't like it. And my name is not Cron. Cron or something. Is that Call of Duty 1? Yes. Sorry. Completely off topic. <laughs> wow. It's huge sentiment. Yeah. But now everybody thinks that we were hardcore gamers. Sure, every kid is a hardcore gamer nowadays. But sometimes you realize it's way cooler outdoors. It definitely is. You meet guys that shoo you off the property with a hay fork. Yeah, I remember that guy. How you switched to this topic, I had no idea. Well, you know, more fun outdoors, you know, that kind of way. <laughs> is, that your, is that your best memory of the outdoors? 
No, but it's definitely a significant one, you know. Man, it's a problem, man, with this freaking mo guy in the area. Streamer guy, streamer guy. I think he just heard you. Freaking neighbor. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I won't be watching. He's got to make a living, too. That's true. Well, I don't think you're making a living with a streamer ever, man. Well, no, he's a farmer. Okay, fair enough. How much time would we still have left? <laughs> like two minutes. Who is that? That is my good luck talisman. <laughs> I like it. Oh man. What to make with your last? No! I think the time is done, man. Well, he got himself a winner there. Ah, the midges. Okay, first priority, getting firewood. Nice, dude. Hey, uh, another challenge complete. Oh yeah. Okay, show me what you got. Well, this is uh, the main item. It's a nice ball plate. I like your uh, good luck buddy, man. But it's a pity that we had so, uh, so little time, or I had so little time, pottering. Pottering. <laughs> pottering. Guess where I'm gonna sit? Yeah, just mind my uh, pot. I got a vase. Uh -huh. I got a vase. I, I like it. The first one I made, it was a lot prettier, but it was too thin. So I had to start over, and then oh. time was of the essence. Initially, before the challenge started, I was thinking about making a fast as well. That would have been Something like you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then a uh, bonus item is a little bowl just thrown together. And I thought this was kind of cool. It's a print of Jaeger's uh, paw. Wow. It's tough. Finding clay is hard. It's a lot yeah. of work. Coming up this Sunday is an extra episode. We blast our primitive oven to the max and use it as a kiln to bake the pottery items. Will they come out in one piece? And who will be the winner? Well, interesting. Then uh, we'll be back with the baked items. Hopefully they'll last. Stay tuned.